Hey everybody, this is Kenny Keene, and this is day number 10 of 100 Days of Making Comics, round 2. Um, today I've been cleaning the house and trying to get things organized. Um, sometimes I don't work as good when things are cluttered and not in its place. Uh, so I've been trying to straighten up uh, my drawing area and just a little bit of everything. The bedroom, uh, just trying to straighten things up. Um, I was going through some Slayer stuff today because uh, I'm going to do, today I'm going to do um, a bigger uh, thumbnail of the next page, which is page 7. I've got to change it up a little bit from my original layout. Uh, I'll show you some stuff uh, that I've, I've dug out and going through, just kind of show you my process. Uh, I found little notes. Like uh, even on an envelope for like uh, bank statements, check stubs, uh, if whatever I got available. If I get an idea for the book, I'll just jot it down. Okay, I've I've been digging through some stuff here. Um, it's my original uh, thumbnail layouts for the book. Um, I dug out. I thought I had uh, a bigger thumbnail. Um, I'll show you what I'm talking about. Um, um, this is the. Uh, small thumbnail book I've done uh, Slayer 1 it's got all the pages in it thumbnailed out and so I can compare it side by side to see how things look and how it flows um, this is page 6 and 7 you can see page 6 changed quite much but the basic uh, premise is there of what's going on um, it's a good foundation you know to start with um, I was then from there I found some more I go to bigger thumbnails to try to get more a little more insight a little more detail on what I want to happen almost like a second draft I guess um, here is what I've got for page six and you saw that yesterday the finished version but this was the uh, bigger thumbnail for that um, it pretty much stayed Pretty much stayed the same. Um, I was hoping I already had page seven thumbnailed out on this size, eight and a half by eleven paper, but I don't. So that'll be what I do today. But I wanted to just show you all my process on how I get from a script, which is right here. Uh, all this stuff had to be dug out. <laughs> Or uh, I've recently moved. Uh, I got Slayer one script. Um, let's see, there's more stuff, and there's a lot of other stuff I've ran across. Little notes I've done while I was at work. I might get an idea for the book, or a cool um, some cool dialogue, or something. You know, something that just jumps out in my head, and I've got to write it down, or I'll lose it. So. Um, there's stuff, um, here's notebooks, um, when they're not present, when I don't have a notebook present, um, stuff like this happens, little random, uh, like this is a envelope with my check stub and some bank statements or something in it, deposit slip, I just grab whatever and just start writing, um, other little scraps of paper I jot stuff down on. I ripped this out of a notebook from somewhere. I don't, I'm not sure where where it came from. This came from work. It's copy paper. I think I had some free time on my break, so I started writing down, uh, laying out some things. Um, this is more up-to-date stuff for the current book. Some of this other stuff was over the years. As I was uh, putting things together, um, this guy, like, uh, this is a scene from a page that I laid out pretty much. And uh, I've got pretty much the script here on the side. And then I've got keynotes over here. Stuff that uh, I wanted to emphasize on. Like, um, there's a character called Brute. Uh, it says Brute should be modeled after Batista. Uh, Batista the wrestler from uh, this is before he was in all these 
cool movies <laughs> like uh, Guardians of the Galaxy and stuff before he really took off. But uh, he was, uh, um, I was basing the character off of his, you know, his looks and stuff, his build. Uh, he's um, basically a flunky for the uh, crime lord in the book. Uh, but he's a, a mean, tough character. Um, and there's some other keynotes for will be with eight ball at club as bodyguard and will be injured in battle with Slayer. Ooh, there's a spoiler. Uh, there's more there, but I don't want to give it all away. Um, <clears throat> anyway, that's a little bit of my process and how I put things together. Um, it's probably a little different now because I've got more free time and I've got notebooks available and stuff. Um, like I was saying earlier, um, there's a, like I just, just curious what some of this stuff is. This was a uh, hip hop, I don't know if it's going to be a hip hop song or a more of a grungy metal type song, but here's some lyrics. It was for Slayer. Uh, I look back, what do I see? An ninja in black coming from me on his chest is a crimson snake. I see flowing blood drenched on his cape. Pretty cool lyrics. Um, just stuff like that hits me and I've got to write it down. <clears throat> uh, his swords are glaring from the full moonlight. Vigilante of the night. For vengeance you will fight. Uh, not sure about that one, but uh, just all kinds of crazy stuff uh, you find, you run across when you're looking for other things and then you find stuff like that and it reminds you like oh yeah I was gonna do something with that um, I was gonna <laughs> I was gonna write a song I think I did write a song and it's somewhere in one of these notebooks uh, and but of course I can't I can't sing I can't rap I can't play instruments so I would have to uh, find somebody pretty talented to uh, take those lyrics and do something with it um, but it's a great idea. Uh, I'm gonna um, I'm gonna flag that so I won't forget uh, because apparently I had forgotten with all this other stuff going on. Um, I guess that's about it. There's more to dig through. I might save that for another video. Um, I'm gonna get to work now. Uh, laying out this um, eight and a half, eleven thumbnail. For page seven, this is the small thumbnail right here. You can see he's fighting a guy with a bat. Um, I had to change page six a little bit, and so seven's gonna be uh, changed somewhat too. Um, there's, uh, I had to take a panel from six, and it's gonna have to be added to seven. So I had to find a cool way to uh, have all that flowing well. You know with the action and stuff um but let's get to work on it i've ran my mouth long enough hope you enjoy watching a little bit of how i operate how uh, my thinking process works
All right, that's it for today. Um, put in about 35 minutes or so on this. Uh, thumbnails, the eight and a half by 11 thumbnail, page seven. I added two extra panels to it um, from what I originally had here, uh, just to make a difference because I mentioned earlier, page six, I had to shovel things around. Um, there's one more page that's the action scene um, that'll go into page eight, so I'll have to alter that a little bit too to make everything flow well. Um, it's really good to be back doing this and to be doing new stuff, to be moving forward with this story. Um, it's been quite a while since I've touched this stuff. Uh, that's all for now. Uh, be sure to like down below, uh, comment, and if you haven't already subscribed, please subscribe. Um, I'll see you all tomorrow. Take care. Fist bump, and I'm out of here.